Hey there, welcome back. I am driving what I consider to be the most dreaded vehicle I have ever played with in Armored Warfare. It is the T6 C13 TUA. It's located in the French dealer and I truly despise this machine. I the swing fire I hated that MN something something I think it's a Norwegian uh, tier 7 I, I'm not a fan of that either but this by far this is just <sighs> yeah so why am I playing it just to show you how much I hate this thing Horacious reload no armor I don't think the camouflage factor even works on this machine. I I just I don't get it. So here we are on stormy winter hardcore. I have uh, top crew, everything on it's unlocked. Everything is put into damage, speed, everything. But these missiles are slow, and these are the top rockets too and look at this reload time see just when you think it's about ready to be reloaded okay reloaded now there's an extra couple of seconds as the thing you know <laughs> pivots up and ready to wow like this is not going to be a good battle See, I've launched how many missiles now? Four. 1810 in damage. Had this been a regular cannon? Yeah. No. I'd probably be over 3,000 by now. And let's wait for you to go green because you are that picky of a. Oh, I actually got something there. And. Ooh. There, it took six hits for missiles to actually get to close to where I'd be if this had just been a regular cannon. If you're a fan of it, all the power to you. I am not a fan of this thing. And playing through it just for the chance to unlock a future tier 7 in the French line. kind of stubborn so I actually am going to play through it I could just free uh, free reputation through it and be ready to go when the tier 7 does drop but I think it's only fair that even as much as I hate this machine ooh I got a kill to play it and that way you know all my criticisms can be justified but this is only me I'm not saying that this machine will be terrible for everybody it's definitely not good for me and so far this battle is going in totally the opposite direction I thought it would. I thought I would be taking a whole lot of damage by now and I'm going to shut up about that because I don't want to literally jinx myself. Wow. Actually I'm putting out some pretty decent damage but this is not my typical type of battle with this thing. Usually I've been spotted. Usually I've taken a whole pile of damage by now. Just yeah. I know there was a Sheridan hiding over there. I don't really want to take a chance on a blind fire. So let's try this. Okay. No, I still got one in the pipe. Should I go for it? Yeah. Let's hope you creep out so I can drop one on you. Not sure exactly where. Oh. Mm, maybe about there if you live long enough? No, you're way too far. You're further away than that. So hit the C key. It goes down. Then the reload clock starts. We're now reloaded, and it pops back up. Yeah, way too long. Far too many battles I've been in. Both pipes are empty. I have to go for a reload, and yeah, life is not good. So far, yeah. Yeah, this is not the typical battle. 
I don't know what's going on. Maybe I'm jinxing myself to have a good one? I don't know, but... I'm playing about as cautious as I usually do, so it's not like I've changed my playstyle doing this. I'm not really being picky about the targets, I'm literally shooting what I'm seeing. Teammates... Okay, the teammates might be doing a little bit better. I mean, I've got four kills. The other TUA's got five. They're not full health kills by any means. I think you got maybe one in there. Wasn't really paying attention. Just been too busy doing what I can do. Uh, oh, there we go. Finally took my first spot of damage. Now if I can get in there, I can take him out. Six kills, almost hit. Okay. Yeah. I think the game's just conspiring against me because I usually do not have this kind of good game in this machine. Still, look at that. Presenting itself, waiting on the reload as it literally just drives off into the sunset. Then when I finally get ready to go, it's gone. Pretty much. Ooh, nice. Okay, seven. Yeah, this is not. There we go. What? I actually bounced that? Are you kidding me? Oh, I'm spotting them, so I might go get spotting damage on them. Yeah, guys, I'm not making this up. Usually, I'm... This is not normal, what's happening right now. This is not... No false modesty, not making up stories. This is like that, not necessarily one in a million game, but this is definitely a game against all odds where... Ah, see, there we go. There's a typical show. Really? Just when I line something up and then the target's gone. Because the missiles move so slow. Now I see my uh, brother in arm there took way too much damage. I don't see anybody around the corner here. We're both tied at nine kills each. Not that I was competing against anybody, but... Ah, a little too close to use that. That is another nasty habit I have. I get way too close and then the missile can fly wide and it just, yeah, it's not good. And you'll be gone. Need somebody a little further away. Okay, that worked. And I thought I was tracked. Woo, there we go. That's a little closer to home. I step out to take a wee bit of a risk and I pay for it. It's literally down to like a third of my health here. Wow. Holy, really? So yeah, so Stormy Winter obviously can be a challenging map on Hardcore. But we didn't get into Tier 7 or Tier 8. Sometimes I've been drug into those. So there's that. Number 2, decent team. I wasn't paying too close attention, but I don't believe anybody died. So that's another big surprise. Um, yeah, 11 kills. I've never pulled that off in this machine before. 13,000 damage, that's never happened before either. I thought for sure this was just going to be a total disaster. Um, shooter, team, I'm going to say came in second. Wow. I am totally like the spawning damage. I knew I did spot a lot, so yeah, that makes that makes all the difference right there. Yeah, 
did not see that coming. Nevertheless, there it is. Here I was bad mounting this machine and look how well I did. First battle of the day. Wow. They didn't die. Nevertheless, I still stand by my opening statement. I don't like this machine. I really don't. And for all the reasons I, uh, you know, talked about before. The long reload time. The unbelievable chance that it actually bounced a few shots. It has blown my mind. And, like I said, have all the good stuff here. You know, increase the rate of fire. I'm running the top missile. Improve control unit to get better control of what's going on. No, actually I got the improved loading mechanism to, you know, rate of fire increase. Everything. Improved commander sight. I went speed, reload, damage, whatever. I won. Came in number two and I lived one life. So there we are. If you actually got anything out of this video or you sat through my whole babbling, by all means give yourself a thumbs up. If you want to give me a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel? By all means, there's buttons to make that happen. Leave comments in the section below. Do you like this? Do you like the C-13? By all means, tell me what you like about it. Or are you like me? This thing is like the bane of my garage. And despite that video where I just showed you I had a great battle, that is not the norm. That is totally, you know, the stars lined up somewhere. Nevertheless, thanks for watching, and until next time, take care.